Hey, Tommy, you've been there in Lexington for uh, quite a while covering this team and this program. How does this year's team compare to some of the other championship teams? You know, the uh, team in 2012 that won the, the championship, um, you know, you had Anthony Davis was leading that team. It was, uh, you know, looks like he's a guy that will be on track to be an NBA Hall of Famer. So uh, that, that, that was a pretty powerful component uh, to have on that team. Um, the 2015 team that won 38 straight, Carl uh, Anthony Towns was the, the anchor there, and he looks like he's on his way to a, a really special uh, you know, superstar type of uh, NBA career um, in you know, multiple first-round draft picks there. Um, so this is a, a team that I don't think it is certainly as good as those two, but uh, all you have to do is be good enough in the year that you're playing. And uh, the, this year I don't think there's a, a team that is as good in this field as the 2012 or the 2015 Kentucky teams were. And, uh, you know, in 2015, Duke won it. You know, Wisconsin was really good. I don't think there are teams in the tournament this particular year that are at that level. So um, you can uh, – some, sometimes it's just, you know, the, the, the year that you're playing, that you're chasing the championship, how do you match up against the others? And I think Kentucky's got uh, – the way they're defending, they've put themselves in a position to be good enough to uh, make a run at, at their ninth title. So uh, we'll see how that plays out. Well, one of those titles, uh, that team was led by our 120 Sports NBA analyst, Antoine Walker. Tom, I don't know, I don't know if you're aware that Antoine's on our team here, but uh, well, what's you, your favorite? you got a good guy on your team there. Yes, we do. <laughs> yes, we do. What's your favorite story or memory of Antoine? Oh, uh, two things immediately come to mind. Number one, the shimmy. Um, <laughs> yes. <laughs> and, and number two, um, his um, uh run uh, as a freshman actually he, he was the mvp of the sec tournament uh that kentucky team uh couldn't win the title but um, they lost the elite eight but came back that core came back and uh won it the next year and, and one of the all-time great uh, kentucky teams and you know he was a you got a guy that size a little magic johnson like quality in terms of being you know six nine but could you know pass it and, and uh and shoot it well um he was just um you know very uh, multi-dimensional player was and a great personality on the court. Yes, he is. and he remains to have that uh, <laughs> continues to have that great personality off the court as well. Hey, Tom, thanks so much for joining us here on the Morning Run. Enjoyed it, guys. Thank you.